give back? Well, you can. And you can do it tomorrow, because tomorrow is Arizona Gives Day. Now, if you're not familiar with it, we have some folks from the New Life Society joining us this morning to tell us more about it and how we can all participate. I want you to meet Desiree Garcia. She's the Special Projects Coordinator, along with Jim Shaw, the new president. Congratulations Thank of the New much. Life Society. Thanks for joining us this morning. Arizona Gives Day, big day tomorrow for charities and foundations. Jim, fill us in. What's this all about? Well, what we've done, or we haven't done it, but we're participating in it, is it's uh, a day they put together every year to try to generate more donations to nonprofits. It's a day to kind of remind and raise awareness that there's a lot of nonprofits out there. Obviously, we'd love it if you, you know, donated to ours. Uh, right. We think we do a good job with it. Mm -hmm. But it's a day to kind of get out and motivate the people and push the people to raise awareness and get some money uh, to fill the coffers, for lack of a better way to put it. And just focus on it all day long and yes. kind of like, okay, today's the day that if you are thinking about making a donation or paying it forward, please do so and, and do it tomorrow. Absolutely, okay. and it's a great time of the year because either A, you just got your taxes back, or B, you see how much you have to pay, and you'll get a write-off on it next year. So Ooh. it's something that helps Is with that as well. Is there a website and it has like the list of all the different charities and foundations that are participating, Desiree? Yeah, the website is azgives.org. Okay. And you just type in New Life Society. And you type in New Life Society and that is one of the reasons why we had you folks come down this morning because what, what you do for the community, I think more people need to be aware of. So tell us about New Life Society, who so, you are and what you're all about. Thank you. New Life Society is a transplant support organization, so we offer support to people who are currently waiting for a transplant or who have had an organ transplant. We offer medication assistance, we have a living assistance uh, fund, and oftentimes people who need a transplant, they fall into financial hardship, and we just want to be there for them um, financially, support-wise. And we also have our education program where we go and we educate students across the valley on the importance of organ and tissue donation. Now do you, is this in conjunction with Donate Life? Is this a separate entity? Talk to me about that. So we are a completely separate entity. Uh, Donate Life, they deal with the donation aspect of it and we are after transplant, after the donation has already taken place and life has been given. So it's people helping people. Exactly. And and transplant recipients helping other transplant recipients. Exactly. So would you walk me through the process here? So let's say I call up and I'm like, you know what? I'm in need of an organ transplant. So I go and I'm hopefully putting my name on lists of Donate Life and other organizations. Then at what point do you step in and you're helping me? We work with the hospitals actually. We have social workers that are in the hospitals that let us know when a family is in need, whether we need to try to scholarship for them or we can do a short term loan or whether they just need the support and the education. So we try to work with them in, in all of those regards and we try to reach out to all the families that we can to help them. Like I said, they need support. That's a lot going on with that kind of stuff. So. Where are you? I know you're out and about several times during the course of the year in the community. Some, and I know that you're also um, heavily involved down at the Capitol and you do a lot of lobbying for this kind of thing. Where can the public like reach out to maybe if they went out to see you someplace or if they wanted to volunteer? I mean, how do they do that? I would advise they go on our website, newlifesociety.org, and just reach out to us that way. We're in so many different places and different times of the week that it's easier for us to say, hey, let's plan something. Go to our website, call us, and we'll figure out a way. A way to help you. Exactly, exactly. And then going back to Arizona Gives Day, is this something where, is there a cap as like how much that somebody could make a donation for, or is it like, I want to send in a donation for $5, or I want to send in a donation for $10,000? Everything they send in will be put to good use, and there are no caps uh, at the top or the bottom. So neither floor or ceiling, they can help out with whatever they're comfortable with. How else do you get your funding? I know now Arizona Gives Day, this is, this is fairly new, isn't it? This has been, what, about the third or third fourth year? year? Yeah, third exactly. year. So, I mean, it's great that the state has decided to do this to help charities and, and different nonprofit mm -hmm. organizations, you know, kind of say, hey, you know, we're, we're setting aside this special day to, to give back. But talk to us about, like, where else, New Life, you get your funding from. We actually get our funding from the Donate Life license plate. Those really? go to educate or 
Exactly. We get our funding from the Donate Life license plate. So the green license plate you see out on the road, that income comes to, comes to us. It costs you $25 a year to get the license plate. $17 comes to us. The other $8 goes to the uh, state to produce the license plate. And I know you can also, another thing that you do is you can sign up at the different grocery stores, right? And they do like a, a non-profit type of thing where like a percentage of what you spend goes to the different nonprofits throughout the state as well, correct? Yeah, so right now we're partnered with Albertsons, Bashes, um, Fries, they all have these community rewards program. So you sign your loyalty card up and you say, I'd like my funds to go to New Life Society and we get a portion every month. Okay, so tomorrow, big day, Arizona Gives Day, and what's the address over there again for that? azgives.org. And they go and they click on it, and then they go down to New Life Society. New Life Society. And say that we want to give to the New Life Society, and they can make the donation there. Or, you know what, you can always go to the newlifesociety.org for more information. We'll be right back with more of the Morning Scramble. And you know what, pay it forward tomorrow. We'll see you soon.